Afro Legends has maybe the worst matchup against uh, Honda. I don't know whether it's Ryu or DJ. I always go back and forth in my mind. But I think that this is a terrible matchup regardless. That said, Kusumondo is so good nowadays that just having a bad matchup is not necessarily the end. Oh, stun? Yes. Yeah, that's it. And he's just going to throw because he knew that was going to kill. You can tech in the middle of moves in this game. So even if you're dizzy or if you're in the middle of move, you can tech a throw. But as I said, when you tech a throw, you actually lose the life and then gain it back. So since that throw was going to kill, there was nothing Kusumundo could have Right, he loses the life before he has a chance to heal. Right. Just gets out of there. The reason it's such a bad match is that those max outs are very difficult for Honda to time his jumps over, despite Kusumando being amazing at it and doing it every time. Oh, but there are other things like that jump back jab, jump all those anti airs. House, yep. Yep. It's so hard for him to get him nice. The short dread kick goes over low do? limbs. That, he was dead. Wow. Just jump jab, and there it is. Apple Legends taking game one very quickly. Great trap. But Kusumando will never change characters. He is a new Honda player to the death. Is Kusumundo thinking about a character nah, change? Absolutely no, absolutely way, No way, no way. That's like me playing someone who's not Kami in this game. That would never happen. Here we go, Kusumundo. You play Ken against me all the time. I do, I do. <laughs> I do, I do. I'm sorry. That's because Honda beats Kami 10 in this game. Uh -huh. Anyway, uh -huh. nice. That jumping roundhouse and that jumping jab just now, beats the, that headbutt. The thing free. about the jumping jab is, yeah, it beats it. On the other hand, Kusumondo still gained a ton of space. He right. was willing to give up that life. Oh, here we go. That's it. Now, oh. after you get stunned by a throw, you actually can't get thrown when you're dizzy. Yeah, that's another glitch. <laughs> that's another glitch. That's why he went for combo there rather than just the easy throw for the kill. Yep. Combo we into super for no reason other than that. He's just super good. Yeah, just felt like doing it for fun. Again, willing to take that damage uh, after the, the back side, who's still a little bit closer than he was before. Wow, messes up the anti-air jab headbutt. And you see how, and, and one of the things that I would like to mention is that the frame data for moves these days is like seven frame startup, nine frame startup, whatever, blah, blah, blah. In ST, I think everything, I swear, is like three frames. Ooh, startup. boom! Here we go. Oh, no, he missed he's, it. He's up. looking for super, he's looking for other options. Oh, and he gets it! Jump kick in the super Kusumundo, the miracle man. He did the jump medium kick, trying to bait Afro Legends into doing a reversal throw, but you can't be thrown during the startup of Honda's super. And so he did that super to bait exactly that. Now, here's another... But okay, never mind. I, I, I keep losing my train of thought. It's all good. It's all good. But Kusumono now has tied it up 1-1. One, one. Trying to navigate this minefield here. Sea of max outs. And he's doing a good job of neutral jumping over stuff. Look at chip damage. It is definitely a factor. You really can't play lame in this game for very long if you're a character who doesn't have a projectile. Nice. Nice safe jump. Safe jumps are so powerful in this game. Okay, nice gets over in. it. He yep. got the knockdown too. He tried to get the hand slap to slide forward. He's not getting a oh wow, a headbutt from nowhere. Oh he tried a shenanigan wow, with that lower house, but he had fierce hands to close it out there. It's very important that Honda try to establish a, a footsie game against DJ when he's, you know, about half screen to a third screen away with things like the, the far stand roundhouse and crouching strong, crouching medium, and hands. He needs to be making those things happen, and Kusumundo has done an excellent job of just that. Yeah, every time, it's kind of interesting because every once in a while, Afro Legends will pause on the fireball throws like that. And it's kind of interesting because DJ is so effective, but now here's the corner. Kusumundo is going to use three-fourths of his life to get him in the corner Ooh. to kill him just like They'll this. They'll go for that. Oh, dude, I thought he was going to go for the ultimate oh. setup. Oh, oh, he just walks up and OGOs him and knocks him dizzy. Kusumundo! Wow. Do you believe what you are seeing here? Kusumundo is just running a train over his opponents. Matches he should not be winning. And of course he's going to stick with DJ. This is a good matchup for Afro Legends, but Kusumundo, he is such a specialized Honda. I mean, he... He, he knows everything. He knows yeah. all the little ins and outs. And at this amount of matchup knowledge, he's been playing this character against DJ for 18 years. <laughs> he knows what to do. <laughs> oh, he got him out of the air. 
Nice reversal from Afro Legends, and he doesn't go for the cross up. I'm surprised he would have got a lot more space to get away from this corner, but as it is, he's still stuck here. Watch out. Oh, great low board got right through uh, nice. Honda's jump roundhouse. It can be tough sometimes to bulldog up as Honda. That is to say, to walk forward and try to block things on reaction. Because some things just become hard to block at certain ranges. So it, it's, it's li a limited functionality. You've seen already that Honda Kusumundo has walked into things that he doesn't want to be walking into. <laughs> But that's, that's what footsies is all about, is that bravery right. of taking that extra step. Now notice when Honda jumps. Notice when Kusumondo jumps. It's very rarely a predictive jump. If you're predicting jumps as Honda against DJ, you are for sure going to lose. So it's mostly on reaction to stuff. Oh, he tried to walk up an Ocho again. But here we go. Afro Legends now has this unlock. You oh. can get stuff in between. But Afro Legends was worried he wasn't charged up in time. Didn't want to risk it. Gets that flash kick. Bad situation to be in for Kusumondo. He thought that there were two options there, that, that uh, Afro Legends would wake up super, in which case you can jump over it, or wait and then do the anti-air up kicks. Right. In which case jumping is not a great idea. He just guessed wrong. You hear that sound there, that they're inserting credits into the machine. This is an arcade board that they are playing on. So no tournament mode in these old in these old, actually the US one has a tournament mode, but the Japanese one does not. So they have to keep inserting the credits. That sound is oral, or is, uh, is audible ambrosia. Yeah, really, right? Oh wow, the jumping forward has slightly better range than that jump roundhouse. So he was able to kick that low forward anti-air from DJ. Oh, nice. And Max Out comes out so fast. It has such a quick startup. Here Ooh. we go, here there, we there go. There are those footies I was talking about. Even though he got blown back, he's establishing the fact that DJ cannot safely throw max outs and press normals at a range where he really needs to. Oh wow, look at this! Oh, you see the jump back? Oh! Baited the fireball so he could super right through it. So good. I don't know how he charged in time for He's that. He's so good. I don't know how he charged in time for that. I honestly don't. And now Kusumundo at match point. This is to get into winner's finals. He's playing. Oh no, this is to get in the grand no, finals. No, it's grand finals. This is currently yeah. winner's finals. Here he is. DJ, Afro Legends has got to try to fight. There's, there's the cross you're talking about. Oh, but no. I don't know why he went for that rather than just smashing jabs and trying to get away. Yeah, you cannot take throw Honda, especially with the store to Ochio. Because once you do that motion, you don't even have to move the joystick anymore. Just kind of piano just the, punches. the punches. Yeah. That's all. It's very broken and super awesome. I hate it. I know you do. I hate it so I, much. I, honestly, I think it's retarded too, but what are you going to do? <laughs> and now the timer's running out. Okay, he's got the chip. Now he's going to be willing to sit there. Afro Legends has got a chip. He, oh. just, he just got the lead. Oh, but he, can he give it up? Oh! It's a tie! It's, it's a, a tie! tie! Are you kidding me? Grand Seriously? <laughs> Winner final? Are you kidding me? And of course, in this game, nobody is awarded a round in that situation. Right. They, they changed that later because they wanted to make sure they got as many dollars as possible out of yeah, the arcade boards. But back in Super, Tur in Super Turbo days, they had not decided on that yet. Great take. He, he went for it! He Let's went for it! Again. Let's he again. went for it! And Kusumundo has taken. And look at him posing to the crowd right there with the Honda hand. He had the Honda hand sticking out. You, sir, are my Street Fighter hero. <laughs>